you are logged into the sim and are ready to start programming your menu items, you're going to go into the back office, located on the main screen. From the back office, you are going to click Inventory Item. You can see that items can be split into groups as well as categories. The category will be more broad than the group. To add a new item category, you're going to click on Add New. Once you have added the new category, you are going to insert the name of the category. You can also add a description. Show order will allow you to decide in which order the categories will be shown. Click anywhere on the screen and you will see that the new category has been added. Once you have finished inserting your categories, you can go into the item group. To add a new item group, you're going to click Add New. You will insert the name of the new group. and its description. As well as the show order. To insert the group into an item category, you're going to double click in the blank item category section. Then you're going to scroll down and click the appropriate category for the group. Again, click anywhere and you will see that the item group has been added. Once you have finished inserting your item groups, you can start to insert the items. To insert a new item, you're going to click Add New. Again, we will enter the name, the description, and the show order of the item. By double clicking in the item group section, you can change it and put it into the appropriate group. Once this is done, you can double click in the barcode section and scan the barcode so that it is connected to the item. If you do not have a barcode to scan, you will skip this step. Now you will make sure that your item is selected. You will insert the price of the item and press save. Once you are finished with your items, you are finished loading your inventory.